also had with a very busy week, something that I don't really follow as closely, but I think it's worth mentioning, is we had the Emmy nominations. Uh, the Emmys, it's so weird how, like, what... Because the window for the Emmys is not a calendar year. It's within a certain time period, so it's really tough to tell. Like, this isn't just, like, all of the shows and seasons that came out in 2023. It's within a certain time period, so, like, Shogun is in this year's Emmys. Very confusing. I don't follow a lot of the whole Emmy discourse because I don't watch a lot of these TV shows, even though I'm aware of many of them. Some of them I watch, but it's, um, yeah, it's, it's crazy packed show with a lot of awards, way more than the Oscars. But let me just read something here from the Hollywood Reporter. Uh, Shogun leads the pack for the 2024 Emmy nominations, which were unveiled Wednesday morning. FX's series landed 25 noms, including Best Drama Series, setting several records in the process. Also among the top nominees are FX's The Bear, with 23 nominations, a comedy series record, Hulu's Only Murders in the Building, um, with 21, HBO Max's T True Detective Night Country, with 19, and Netflix Netflix's The Crown, with 18 nominations. Yeah, um, so kind of the main narrative when it comes to Emmys nominations is that basically the people that vote for the Emmys, it's, they don't, they're only watching a few of the most popular TV shows, right? I mean, we have this complaint, you know, in, in film Twitter with, like, the movie scene where the Oscars, there's so many movies that release in a year. I mean, you're, you're talking thousands, if we're being completely honest, like hundreds of thousands, and the Academy only watches a handful of movies that they're able to get to, you know? Uh, and so... It's, it's, it's even more crazy with TV shows because we're talking hours worth of content when we're talking a TV series. So it seems like every year the, the, the pool from which the Emmys are pulling from for all of the awards is smaller and smaller and smaller where it's only about, you know, a pool of five to ten different TV shows that are actually getting nominations, you know, because they're the most popular and they're the ones with the most hype, as opposed to really seeking out all of the different TV that was released in, in a year, you know? Um, it, but, but yeah, it's like every Emmys season, it seems like there's a new show that is breaking records of, oh my God, it got 100,000 nominations, you know? Uh, because these are only the few TV shows that people are actually watching, not necessarily that they're the best, but yeah, I mean, big, big story for this year is Hulu is where it's at when it comes to TV. Uh, right now, Hulu is king when it comes to TV. They got Only Murders in the Building, The Bear, Shogun. It's, they're, they're winning so hard, um, specifically FX with the bear and shogun which a lot of i think all of fx's stuff is traditionally on hulu i imagine right but yeah it's it's all hulu this year we don't have uh succession anymore to sweep up all the nominations you know um the crown on netflix i feel like i only hear about the crown when it comes to emmy season i don't ever hear anyone talk about the crown or know anyone that watches the crown <laughs> and and this is the last season i'm kind of happy not to have the crown in the conversation when it comes to the emmys because i feel like it's been going on for a while now and yeah i just i only ever hear about the crown when it comes to emmys i never hear anyone talk about the crown no, i don't know anyone that watches the crown but yeah um I mean, yeah, HBO, True Detective. I don't watch True Detective. I know it's really popular, but yeah, it's um, yeah, it's definitely Hulu's year for the Emmys. I mean, I love Shogun so much. I have some issues with it, but I, 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 it was the best TV that I saw this year, aside from Smiling Friends. 
it was, you know, as far as limited series go, that first season of Shogun was amazing. Um, going to be doing a season two now, so it was not submitted under the limited series category. That was like a tactical thing. I don't know how a season two will shake out. I'm, it's going to be real tough for me to get back into Shogun if they don't bring back John Blackthorn. I, I'm, I don't know. That original cast is so great. If if it's not going to be focusing on them, I don't know how much I'm going to enjoy it. But uh, the bear, I just, I, I, the bear's just not my thing. I know it's a really good show that everyone loves. Is it a comedy? I don't know. Probably not. Who cares? But you know, I've seen Shameless, and I watched Shameless for years with Jeremy Allen White. And I know the bear is much different from Shameless. I feel like the bear is a much more structured and focused version of Shameless. I feel like the bear, from what I've seen of it, shares a very similar tone to Shameless. Maybe not as outrageous, but I, I can see just, just tonally it's hitting a same thing that I feel like Shameless did. And I just kind of experienced that already. And I I just don't I don't I don't need to experience the bear. I've just it's just not for me. But I can totally understand why it's so popular and why people love it. And I'm glad Jeremy Allen White is getting uh the recognition that he he deserves. I mean, so many of those kids on Shameless I thought were fantastic, specifically uh, Jeremy Allen White and Cameron Monaghan, those two brothers, who uh, is what's his name, Cal, in that in that uh, Jedi Fallen Order video game. But yeah, he should get a lot more stuff. But yeah. Uh, anyway, the Emmys, they're a thing. There are you know a handful of TV shows that people watch that'll get a million nominations. Uh, Eric Andre getting his first nomination for the Eric Andre Show. Very happy with that. We'll see if he actually wins, doubt it, but anyway, I'll probably watch them when they're on. I don't even know when they're on, but uh, yeah, you know, it's, it's Hulu's year for TV, that's for sure.